What's up everybody? It's your boy Coke Gotti coming at y'all with another video. In this video, we're gonna get in my predictions for week six. Before we start, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button and let's ride. All right, starting off, we got Stanford against Arizona State. Stanford coming off of the big upset win against Oregon. Arizona State coming off of, I guess in the Pac-12 world, a big statement win against UCLA. I'm going to pick Arizona State. I think Arizona State's the better team. And Stanford's probably going to be hung over from the win against Oregon. But I do expect it to be a fight. I don't think Arizona State's just going to win it. They're going to have to earn it. Then we got Maryland versus Ohio State. And everyone knows I've been high on Maryland all year. They let me down last week against Iowa. I got them losing this game to Ohio State. It could be a close one, but I think Ohio State is going to win it. Honestly, it'd probably be a blowout, but <clears throat> Maryland's still a good team. And we got Oklahoma versus Texas. Red River rivalry. I debated on this game. When I was making my picks, I went through all my picks, left that one alone because I couldn't pick. And then came back to it today, right before I made this video and made my pick. So, I'm taking Oklahoma. I wanted to take Texas because Oklahoma hasn't been looking good at all. I mean, Texas, honestly, hasn't been looking great either. But I think Oklahoma will get the recipe and uh, win the game. It'll probably be a close one, though. Probably win it. I don't even think it'll be a shootout. I think it's going to be an ugly game. But I got Oklahoma squeaking by. Then we got Arkansas versus Ole Miss. Arkansas coming off their loss to Georgia. Ole Miss coming off their loss to Bama. Both teams came into those games last week with high hype. Both teams got their pride hurt. I'm picking Arkansas to win this game and bounce back. And get the win on Ole Miss, bounce back, and get back on track and making the, their run for the season. And we got West Virginia against Baylor. Baylor lost last week. Oh, West Virginia lost last week too. I was high on Baylor until last week. Last week they kind of killed all the uh all the hype that I was giving them and I really don't want to take them, but I'm taking West Virginia in this game. I feel like West Virginia will get the win, bounce back off of their loss. Defense probably be a little too much for Baylor. I got West Virginia winning that. And we got Georgia versus Auburn. Georgia. Auburn's Georgia's bitch. That's that. There's nothing else to it. Bo Nick's going to be laying on his back all game long. And we got Penn State versus Iowa. Number three versus number four. When I was first making my picks, I picked Penn State. But then I went back over it, thought about it. And I've been going against Iowa. I went against Iowa when they played Indiana. I went against Iowa when they played Iowa State. I went against Iowa last week when they played Maryland. I'm taking Iowa. You know, I mean, knowing my luck, the time I finally fucking take them, they're going to end up losing. But I'm taking Iowa in this game. They made me a believer. Penn State's a good team, but... <clears throat> They haven't made me a believer yet, so I'm taking Iowa in this game. Then we got Notre Dame versus Virginia Tech. Notre Dame coming off the loss to Cincinnati. Going into Blacksburg, looking to rebound. And I don't think they're going to do it. I got Virginia Tech. I think Virginia Tech is going to be at the house. The crowd's going to be in it. And it's just it's, it's hard it's hard to win in Blacksburg. That's just It just is. Their name might get the win, but I'm I'm riding with Virginia Tech on this. Then we got LSU versus Kentucky. I'm taking LSU. I feel like Kentucky's going to be coming in here, hung over off of that win against Florida, and LSU is going to squeak by with a win. Derek Stingley's out all year. I don't think that matters. Kentucky, I don't. Honestly, I, I don't. I don't see how they are, with what where they're at right now. But I'm taking LSU to win the game. Then we got Bama versus A&M. I'm taking Alabama. 
honestly, besides Georgia, I feel like Bama is the only other team in the country that's on, on that top level. I feel like Georgia and Bama are the only elite status teams. Texas a and is highly overrated. Coming into the season, they was highly overrated. And even now with Haynes King being out since he's been out since fucking the Colorado game or whatever, they've been overrated the whole time. And they're just not, this is not that good of a team. Like everyone hypes them up to be as if it's fucking, <coughs> I don't know. Jimbo Fisher, the teams they had the years with Kellen Mond, they just get all that hype for some reason, but they're not who they are. They're, they're really not. And Bama's going to shut them boys down. But that's my picks. Make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. I'll have the uh, results video out Sunday, Monday, after the games are played. And so, since we're at the midway point of the season, I'll be dropping out an updated playoff predictions video, conference championship video. So make sure you hit that like and subscribe button so you don't miss all that. It's your boy, Coke Gotti, and I'm out.